Hi, welcome to today's episode of 5 Minute Comics and we will be talking about unicorns today. Let's start off by talking about what exactly is a unicorn. A unicorn is a startup, typically a tech one, that has reached a billion dollars in valuation. And many of these startups that we're familiar with like Netflix, Uber, Grab, WeWork, there's something in common with all of these startups or unicorns. What is it that they have in common? They are loss making. I'm going to share with you three ways of categorizing these loss making strategies. The first way will be the Predator. Now what the Predator wants to do is to actually gain market share. So by doing so, they actually subsidize the heck of every single product or service that they're selling. If something is worth $5, they will subsidize you $4.90. And the reason they, they want to do that is because they want to gain market share rapidly. So they want to chase out competitors with their low pricing and they want to win customers from their competitors. And that is what some of these startups do. And the second way of categorizing it will be to look at the content creator. The content creator is a unicorn that seeks to actually increase its ownership of intellectual property. For example, if it creates 10 different types of content and one of it makes it into a successful franchise. I'm sure you can think of some very successful brands or franchise that you actually are familiar with when you watch Netflix. Like for example, Game of Thrones is a very, very successful franchise. And these content creators can end up making a lot of money for them down the road. Not necessarily now, but in the long term, they will actually gain from selling of, say for example, merchandise, digital rights to the movies or to the shows. And lastly, we look at one last strategy which is called the big exit. Now these firms, they do not focus so much on the product quality or to actually gain market share. Their focus is on one thing. And what is this one thing? Which is to actually exit with a very, very large valuation. So for example, if it's worth $100 million now, their hope is that in two years down the road, they'll be worth $500 million. And five years down the road, they'll be worth $1 billion. And so that they can exit with a large amount of equity. Now, most of these firms, they will appear that they are not interested in profits. It is not that they are not interested in profits, but they have choose to sacrifice short-term profits for long-term profits. So this is what all three strategies have in common. They are not looking at profits in the short run, but they're looking at profits in the long run. They want to gain market share dominance. They want to gain intellectual property rights, which is actually a form of barriers to entry. And most of them, they eventually want to be the monopoly. And being a monopoly means that you are able to eventually set high prices. So you can recoup back some of the losses that you have made subsidizing in the earlier part of the game. And that's Eugene from 5 Minute Economics. We'll catch you on the next one. Thank <laughs> you.